Hey guys, my name's Jamin. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. In this video, I have a Gateway tablet laptop on me. The exact model is GWTC116. I'll have the full model number below in the description. I'm gonna show you how to get inside, access your battery. So first thing guys, power down the computer the correct way. Make sure it's off and unplugged from your charger. Then we're gonna flip it over to access your bottom case screws. Okay, so we have these four screws here, these two in the middle. And these four up top, we're going to remove all those screws. After the screws are removed, we'll take a small flat pry tool and we'll go across the entire seam and pry the bottom case off from the computer. When you're doing that, don't put your pry tool too far in. You could damage some internal components. Keep it on the outside edge and just go slow but firm. And if you get stuck in one spot, leave it and continue around the other direction. Okay, so that was actually a real pain in the butt to take off. Um, there are no components holding it down. There are no ribbon cables. It's just very tough to get that off. So. Uh, go slow and firm, <clears throat> definitely firm to take that off. After you get your bottom case off, this is what you're looking at for the inside of the computer. This is your battery right here. It's held on by one, two, three, four screws that I can see. I'm gonna also look under these tape tabs, see if there's anything in there, but I'll take out those screws first. As a tip, whenever you're working on a computer, keep the screws in different parts of the computer and different components separate from each other. They're not all the same size and you could damage things by trying to use the wrong size screws. So keep your battery screws separate from your bottom case screws um, and anything else you're working on. So let's look under these tabs here for the battery plug and for any of the screws. Okay, nothing under there. Okay, that's the battery plug right there. Okay, and there's one more battery screw right there. So we'll go ahead and take that battery screw out. And the battery plug is right there. Whenever you're working on a computer, try to avoid pulling wires, if at all possible. Try to just manipulate that plug. So this plug has two grips on either side. I can grab it with my fingernails or a pry tool and just pull that right out of the port. So that is how your battery comes out of this computer. If you guys want the battery specs, uh, this is a 7.6 volt battery. Looks like 41.8 uh, watt hour. And the model name is pretty long. Um, I'll have it below in the description if you guys are wanting a replacement for this. Okay, so there's the video. I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, check out the FAQs in the description below first. It could save you some time getting an answer. But if you do need to leave me a question or comment, please feel free. I do try to get to those a couple times a day at least. As always, please remember to like and share if this was helpful, if you think it could help someone else. Please subscribe if you enjoy DIY computer content. And if you want to support the channel a little further and leave a small donation, there's a couple different ways you can do that. First, right below the video to the right hand side, you'll see the super thanks button. You can click on that. You can select a tip amount here. Second way, you can use your cash app. Find me at dollar sign PC helper. You can leave a dollar amount and you can even leave a little note. Thanks so much for watching guys. I look forward to seeing you on my next video.